Hello everybody, what is up? I am finally here for another video. Happy Thursday to all of y'all. I feel like I have nothing in my closet and I have so many clothes. I was going to like a brunch thing today with my friends and I was like, I literally cannot figure out what I wanna wear. And then I realized I have clothes, I just don't like any of them. So today we are going to fix that. We are currently in that in-between stage of it is winter question mark is it spring are we gonna get colder are we gonna get hotter i have no freaking clue what is about to happen it's almost february and i don't know so i have had a thing in my car of clothes that i didn't know if i was going to get rid of them or if I was gonna try to sell them. And I honestly haven't looked at it since I moved. I'm gonna go through it. I'm gonna figure out what stuff I'm gonna take to sell. I'm gonna let you guys know how much money I make from selling. And then I'm either gonna buy new clothes or I'm gonna pocket some money and maybe buy a couple things. But I'm just very unhappy with my closet right now. And there needs to be a change. And I like watching videos where like I can see what kind of money people are making from different things. So I figured why not just make this into a video since I have to do it anyways. So for what I have decided, I think, with all of my freaking clothing, is I am going to go through organize it and then take it in to sell it for the pieces that I think will sell and then the clothes that don't actually sell that are really cute still I'm gonna put up on Poshmark like I've got some really cute stuff also this video is not sponsored by Poshmark I know they're sponsoring everything right now but not this video so I have like a mix of like real bags so this one's a Kate Spade that I got when I worked there and then this one's a Kate Spade that I got when I worked there and then I have this one this little mini backpack that I got and this was a dupe actually I spent like $50 on it and I maybe carried it once or twice anyways oh hi what's up baby you want me in the are you really gonna burp in my face you're disgusting huh <laughs> Anyways, so I'm going to start and go through everything and then kind of go from there and figure out what I want to sell because I have some really cute things in here. Like, I got this evening dress from Show Pow. I literally never wore it and it is so freaking cute. It's just like a long evening dress with a slit in the side. I literally don't know why I never wore this. Oh, I don't know how I'm going to do this. So I called the store and I asked them what kind of pieces they're looking for right now because... I won't be getting rid of like flare jeans or anything like that that I actually want to wear. So I mean like looking through this like I don't know what I'm going to do. Like I have some Nikes in here but they're kind of beat up. So it's like do I want to just try to take everything and go from there or like what? Oh my god there's a lot of stuff in here. Like this dress is so cute. I wore this sequin dress to my last sorority formal it's like a sequin open back like really pretty dress like i love this stuff i can't believe i, I never took any of this in i probably could have made some money over the spring and then mia just wants to like lay in the middle of everything <laughs> my life is a mess <laughs> okay okay i'm gonna do like a montage video while i sort it so you guys can kind of see some of the clothes or whatever i don't know what i'm doing this video is literally i don't know what this video is <laughs> We made progress. It took a hot minute, but I ended up making it into one of these with a ton of stuff coming out of the top. And then I had this bag from Christmas and it looks like this. It's huge. Um, I'm actually really excited about the stuff that I'm selling. I feel like it's pretty good quality stuff that's not like really that out of season, but what do I know? Maybe nobody should be wearing that kind of stuff. I don't know. But so next what I'm going to do is take pictures of the bags that I'm going to be posting up on my Poshmark. I bought this really cute rug for my office. It's this really soft pink rug 
and Mia is literally chilling on it. She's obsessed with it, but it's really cute in pictures. I'm going to take pictures on here. Oh, I forgot these too. Yeah, I bought these like striped pants, but they fit me really weird. They're like weird around my legs, so I'm going to get rid of those too, which I'm kind of bummed about that because I thought they were really cute and I never wore them. Okay, it's been a little bit of a minute now, but I got three of the bags posted on my Poshmark. I completely forgot that I had this really cute Kate Spade leather wallet that I just never really used, so I posted that up on there. Um, little side note is... I can't post these because they're not real. Apparently it's not illegal to buy them, but it's illegal to sell them. And I'm not trying to get in any trouble. So any recommendations, sound off below. Mia got her toy, so it's time for me to get off Good morning, this. everybody. It is the next day, so I'm going to go sell my clothes at some point today. I have a photo shoot this morning that I'm doing, and then afterwards I'm gonna go take everything over and see what I can get from it. So I will keep you guys posted. Hope you guys are having a great day today and I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so it has been a very long day. It's about four right now, three. It's about four right now. And I just got to Uptown. It's right here, Uptown Cheapskate. And I'm about to take my clothes in. Hopefully they take two bags because I think sometimes I only take one if it's like too many people selling at once. So I will keep you guys posted, but I'm gonna shop around while they go through my stuff. So I'll see you in a sec. Okay guys, I am back finally after like an hour and a half. How long was it? I was in there for exactly one hour and they worked really fast. I actually was like shopping around trying to find what I wanted to buy if they gave me store credit. Basically, this ah, is what they gave me back. And honestly, there's just a couple things in this red bag. And then let me show you like a good amount of stuff in this one, but nothing crazy they basically took everything that i expected them to take all of like some of the newer styles that i had that just weren't fitting right or like didn't look the way i wanted them to so let's do the rundown of what i got and all that and they were running a promotion right now or if you were to take the store credit which ends tomorrow you would have got 20 percent more back but when i was trying on all the clothes i showed you guys some clips i tried on like 15 different things and the only thing I ended up buying were these booties. And they're so freaking cute. They're like leopard print and they're a shorter heel. And I just really love the style, but they were $13 and they're from Old Navy. And I really like them, but there was nothing else that I tried on that I was like, holy crap, I have to have this. So when it came down to it, they took 25 different items from me, which is really freaking good compared to like a Plato's Closet or something. Plato's Closet doesn't give you very much money. 25 items, they offered me $80 cash or $112 in store credit. So honestly, I did a million times better than I actually thought I was going to do. I thought I was going to get like no money back. So I would definitely recommend going to a store like this if you have one in your area rather than going to like, I don't know, Plato's Closet. Because Plato's Closet is great, but it's just not, you're not going to get as much money back as you wish you would. So that's what I got back. Now that I have $80 cash, well these were 13, so I spent that. Now that I have a little bit of money left, I'm putting it aside and I've told myself that I'm not going to spend it on anything except for new clothes for the spring season or the end of winter. So what I think I'm gonna do is do like a mall haul sometime and then I'll make it into another video so if you guys are curious on what I do with my money and the clothes that I end up getting from my mall haul, Stay tuned for that because it will be coming out shortly when I actually have time to go shopping, which will probably be next weekend. So, I gotta get through this busy week and then I'm gonna go shopping and treat myself. So yeah, I mean, I'm really excited. They did not know I was vlogging. They did not know I was doing this for a video. So it's not like they were expecting and took more than they would normally would. Pretty impressed with the amount of stuff they took. I'm really happy to have this out of my closet. So um, there's nothing really in here that I can see myself reselling so what I think I'm gonna do is like give it to a friend to go through or 
something along those lines to someone that would like it more than me just because they did take everything that I was gonna post on Poshmark so I'm really happy about that I don't know how this video is even gonna turn out or if it's interesting to y'all because I didn't really show you guys all the items that I put up I hope you guys like this video um Hopefully there'll be many more and I'll be more in depth with what I'm selling and like what I'm getting and everything. But comment down below what you thought and I will have my haul from what I actually made from this video up very shortly. So I will see you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.